winning its second consecutive SWAG title, Alcorn State will play in the inaugural Celebration Bowl right here on 16 WAPT on December 19th. 16 WAPT's Josh Jackson caught up with the Braves this week, and they say it all starts with their fearless leader. Prior to Jay Hobson's arrival in Lorman, the Alcorn State football program was in shambles. The team had experienced five consecutive losing seasons under four different head coaches. We just knew coming in here, I'm like, this program, you know, is really in a, in a hole. When I got here, I can promise you, I wasn't expecting for us to win back-to-back -back championships. Yeah, during Anthony Williams' freshman year, not many people did. Coach Hobson will lead us forward. Then oh, entered Jay Hobson, the first non-black coach in SWAC history, set to lead the Purple and Gold. We grew up together, man. Just four years at the helm, Hobson has compiled a 32 and 16 record, not to mention two SWAC championships. Hobson not only raised expectations, he changed the culture. It was about, you know, a brotherhood, you know, a family, you know, and everybody working as one. He always preached to us that we were going to be on top. The journey we went through was, was a journey. You know, we, we took our knocks early. Started 4 and 7. You know, we had some pretty tough, embarrassing losses. I remember distinctly, you know, going to James Madison, Arkansas State, losing by over 50 points. It's safe to say Alcorn State started from the bottom. Now they're here. Here being the inaugural celebration bowl in Atlanta, Georgia. It's just a blessing, you know, to play in the very first celebration bowl to represent Alcorn State University. The Braves are loaded with dynamic playmakers. Running back Darian Ragsdale averages eight yards a carry. SWAC newcomer of the year, Marquise Warford, has racked up more than 1,400 yards of total offense. And on the other side of the ball, the Braves led the conference in total defense. Alcorn now with a shot at back-to-back 10-win -back seasons. But it all started with players buying into Hobson's vision nearly four years ago. I got to thank Coach Hobson for building such a team like that. Uh, we're just going to keep working on each other and just keep building. Coaches and players speak highly of him because he's so sincere and genuine. I believe him and he's going to push us on top of two championships. To look back at us leaving here now like, man, we really put a stamp on the program. They kept fighting, they kept working, they kept preparing, and, uh, you know, and they're just a tremendous special, they're a special group to me. Reporting from Lorman, Josh Jackson, 16, WAPT Sports.